Can we not clap? Let's just focus on him right now. Bright Gain said, Through wisdom, God made, God founded the earth. By understanding, He established the heavens. Out of my knowledge, all the rooms are filled with pleasant and precious riches. How can we operate on the earth without wisdom, without understanding, without knowledge? Mm -hmm. When by wisdom, God who created the heavens and the earth established the earth, founded the earth. By understanding, he established it. And by knowledge, he filled the chambers with precious and pleasant riches. Can we lift up our hands to him this evening and say, Lord, I need you. 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 In your own words, just begin to express your need for the Lord. You know, you will not worship if you don't see your need for him. Worship commences with the consciousness of our need for him. Oh, he is here. So just rest in his presence. Just relax in his presence. Forget about the people around you this evening. This is an alone time with the Lord. A time of being alone. Just you and the Lord alone. Mm. Oh. Oh. I need you. Oh Lord, I need you. Without you, oh Lord, there is nothing I can do. Everything I am is dependent on you my strength my trust my hope is in you with you i can do all things with you i can do all things it's very simple say oh lord oh oh lord i need you i need you in my life oh, lord. i need you i need you without you without you oh lord there is nothing i can do Nothing I can do. Everything I am, everything I am is dependent on you. Dependent on you. My stress, my trust, my hope. Lord, my stress, my trust, my hope. My strength, my strength, my trust, my hope is in you, with you, with you, I can do all things, nothing is impossible, with you, I can do all things, oh, Lord this evening 
and say, oh, oh Lord, I need you. Oh Lord, without you, without you, oh Lord, there is nothing I can do. Everything I am is dependent on you. Lord, my strength, my trust, my hope is in. Lord, my strength, my trust, my hope is in. Lift up your hands and my strength, Lord. My trust, my, trust, my hope is in you, with you, with you. I can do I all can things, do I can do all things. things. Oh Lord, nothing is impossible with you, oh, with you, I can do all things. And you just bask in that, say with you, Lord, with you, I can do I can all do things. things. All things with you, with you, I can do all things. You know, we need to stop looking to ourselves. If you're looking to yourself, all you will see are your weaknesses. All you will see are your limitations. But when you take your eyes off yourself, and begin to look unto him in whom you live, in whom you move, in whom you have your being. Hallelujah. Then his ability begins to rise up from within you. Hallelujah. His power begins to rise up within you. His energy begins to rise up within you. He begins to show you his wisdom. Behold the Lamb. Behold the Lifted up at Calvary, behold the Lamb, behold the Lamb, lifted up at Calvary. Hanging in my place. Oh, yes, I know. He is hanging in my place. As I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive my lead. Can you behold the Lamb? Behold the Lamb. Behold the Lamb. Behold the Lamb. Lifted up. Lifted up. Oh, Rebo Behold the Lamb. Behold the Lamb. Oh, yes. Let's behold the Lamb of God. As I see the Lord, as I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive, I receive my liberty, my liberty. One more time, can we declare? Behold the Lamb. Let's behold the 
Lamb of God <laughs> lifted up. If you're sick in your body, open your mouth and declare to that sickness. He is hanging in my place. Jesus is hanging in my place. Oh, as I see the Lord, as I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive my liberty. My liberty. Lift up your voice. The Lord, as I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive, I receive my liberty, my liberty, as I see Him on the cross, as I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive. Reba Boshendera, my liberty. Reba Basenga Yabara. Oh, can you lift up your voice and begin to say, Lord, say, Lord Jesus, you were wounded for my transgressions. <laughs> you were bruised for my iniquities. <laughs> the chastisement that was required for me to enjoy peace. Peace in every area. Peace within myself. Peace in my spirit. Peace in my soul. Peace in my body. Peace in my home peace in my family peace in every area the chastisement required for me to enjoy peace was laid upon you by your stripes i am healed you have taken my place you have taken my place you have carried all of my sicknesses you have borne all my griefs can you lift up your say lord i receive my liberty i receive liberty in your presence for where the spirit of the lord is there is liberty we are, we are, we are seeds of Abraham, because we are believed in Christ, so we are blessed with faithful Abraham. Oh, Jesus looked at that woman that had been sick for, for, for 12 years, and he said, Oh, ought not this woman being a daughter of Abraham, whom the devil had bound this 12 years be loose from my from my sicknesses and infirmity. Can you lift up your hands? I say, Lord, I thank you that the devil has no right over me. He has no right over me. Before your presence, I receive, I receive liberty. Oh, what is that area in which you need liberty, where you need liberty right now? You are not looking to any man. You are not looking to any prophet this evening. You are not looking to any pastor. You are looking to the Lord. We are beholding the Lord himself. As I see the Lord upon the cross, I receive my liberty. You know what? James said, if any man lacks wisdom, let him ask of God who gives liberally and does not upbraid. He doesn't seek fault. He doesn't remember the last sin that you committed or the last disobedience that you did. He gives liberally because he's merciful. Merciful. You are merciful, full of mercy, Father, merciful, you are merciful, full of mercy. 
Father, can you sing that to your Father? Merciful, merciful. You are merciful. You are merciful. Full of mercy. Full of mercy. Father. Father. You are merciful. merciful. Yes, you are merciful. You are merciful. Full of mercy. Full of mercy. <laughs> Abba Father, Father, hear this. I never knew mercy until I met you through your Son, Jesus Christ, my Lord. Hallelujah. I found mercy. In your eyes When you forgave my sins And you changed my world Merciful You are merciful Full of mercy So you can come to him at all times Mercy, Abba <laughs> Father, so with all of my heart, with all my heart, I want to thank you. I want to thank you, Lord, for your mercy, for your mercy upon my life. Upon the rock to stay. Upon Can you lift up your hands and say, With all my heart, all Lord, my heart. I want to thank you, Lord. Thank, thank you, Lord, Lord, for your mercy. For, for your, your mercy. <laughs> we are saved. We are not destroyed. Upon we are not consumed because of his mercy. You picked me up, you picked me <laughs> up. from the merry clay. And you set my feet <laughs> upon the rock to stay. Mercy changed me, rearranged me. I lift up my hands and I thank you, Father. Mercy picked me from the ground. Mercy turned my life around. I lift up my hands again and I thank you. Rebel Cedar. Mercy reached me and then reached me. My hands and I thank you, Lord. Father, you are, you are, you are, you are merciful, <laughs> you are merciful. full of mercy. Full of mercy, Father. 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 One more time, I declare, merciful. You are merciful. You are merciful. You're full of mercy.
Oh, let's lift up our hands to our Father. You are blessed. Your steadfast love never sees it. You are merciful. Lord, you are merciful. Full of mercy. Abba, Father. One more time. Father, just love your father. Oh, Rekabara and Shada. Even if your earthly father, oh, Rekabara was cruel to you, was wicked to you, you have a father in heaven. Hallelujah. We have a father in heaven who loves us, who cares for us, who is always there for us. Oh, Lord, I love you. I return to you, you are my first love, I return to you, my beginning and my end, I return to you, Jesus. Son of God, all over again. I long to be your friend. Yes, Lord. I return to you. You are. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord. I long to be your friend. I long to be your friend. Say that, let the Lord hear you this evening. I return. I Can we sing it one more time? Lord, I return with all my heart. I return to you. You are, you are my first love. I return to you. My beginning, my beginning, and my end. I return to you. Jesus. I long to be your friend. I long to be your friend. Yeah, this, you know what? Abraham was a man like me, yet he was a friend of God. That is what you are to me, Jesus, Son of God. Rather than depend 
hand on your mighty head Lord I straight to a foreign land but now I return I return to <laughs> you back into talking terms with you oh yes oh lord i want to get back oh lord into those former things i used to do with you lord all over i long to be your friend oh i remember from ways of falling i get back to doing the former works i all over oh lord i long to be oh lord i long to be your to the Lord. I long to be your Oh, isn't that lovely? <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, it's so beautiful to be the friend of the Lord again. <laughs> a terrible thing to be an enemy of God. You know what Jesus said? He said, you are my friends if you do what I command. That you should do. He said, All that the Father, he said, I no longer call you servants because a servant doesn't know what his master is doing. But he said, All that the Father has shown to me, I've declared them to you, I've made them known to you. So you're my friend. You're my friend. That's what the Lord is saying from his exalted position at the right hand of the Father. He's calling you friend. And he wants you to come back to being friends with him. Oh, say, Lord, you are my first love. I don't care who in the world your first love was. Say to him, say to him, say, Lord, you are my first love. Say, you, you are the love of my life. My wife is sitting down over there. Hallelujah. But she knows that the Lord is my first love. He's the first love of my life. Is the first love and you know that's the most secure place to be to rest in the love of god you know perfect love what does it do to fear cast out fear. Cast out fear hallelujah you know all the young people here that you're not married yet make the lord your first love when it becomes your first love he's the one that will point out that person to you and say see that you know god can say baby see that baby right there so that's a person. He did it to me. You understand what I mean? And even after being married, it needs to remain your first love. There are some of us that as soon as we got married, we replaced the Lord with our spouses. And that's why we keep having problems. But we need to get back to making the Lord our first love. Hallelujah. How many of us know that we have come onto Mount Zion this evening? We have come unto Mount Zion, the city of the living God. Hallelujah. We have come to an innumerable company of angels. There are angels all around us here right now. We have come unto God, the judge of all. We have come to the spirits of just men made perfect. We have come to Jesus Christ, the mediator of the new covenant. We have come to the blood of sprinkling that speaks better things than the blood of Abel. And how many of us know that on Mount Zion there shall be what? There shall be deliverance. And there shall be what? Holiness. And the sons of Jacob shall possess their possessions. Hallelujah. And we shall exchange. If there are ashes in your life, he will give you beauty. Hallelujah. If there are areas where you are mourning, he will comfort you. Do you hear? Oh, oh, oh. Bring it on. We have come unto Mount Zion, the city of the living God. 
This is the mountain of the Lord, the joy of the whole world. Guess what? God is here. Let's acknowledge Him and lift up an offering. Mount Zion, city of the living God, city of the living God. Heavenly Jerusalem, there shall be deliverance. There shall be deliverance here in God's presence. There shall be holiness by the Spirit of the Living God. There shall be deliverance here in God's presence. There shall be holiness on Mount Zion. On Mount Zion. Heavenly Jerusalem. Let's do it one more time so that everybody can sing along. Mount Zion, Mount Zion, city of the living God, city of the living God. Mount Zion, Mount Zion, heavenly Jerusalem, heavenly Jerusalem. There shall be the liberate, here in God's presence. Jerusalem, heavenly Jerusalem. We have come unto Mount Zion to receive the latter rain, the outpouring of the Lord. We wash away our shame. <laughs> we'll see visions, we will prophesy. By the spirit of Adonai, Mount Zion, city of the living God. Oh, come on, Mount Zion, Mount Zion, heavenly Jerusalem. <laughs> yes, they shall be. Holy 
shall be deliverance. Deliverance is already taking place. Lift up your hands and just talk to the Lord. Thank him. Thank him. For the gifts that are released unto you. The graces that are released upon you. Oh yes, we have come unto Mount Zion. Where there is the outpouring of his spirit. Can you sing in the spirit? Oh, Rebaba, my younger Rebaba. Oh, sing, sing, Rebaba. Rebaba, my younger 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 Rebaba. We worship in the beauty of your holiness. Oh Lord, thank you, Lord, for breaking yokes, O oh Lord. Yokes, O oh God, of ungodly habits, O oh God, that have held your children bound, O oh Lord. Thank you for breaking them, breaking them in pieces, breaking them in pieces. Oh, for greater is he that is on the inside of you than the devil, than the sin, than the loss, than the corruption, than the violence that is in the world. Oh, regather for you, oh God. You are able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we ask or think according to your power that works within us. Oh, can you lift up your hands and say, Lord, I thank you for your power. Your power that is at work within me. Oh, Re Babara. Akaba, declare that. Just declare that. I thank you for your power. The exceeding greatness of your power. The exceeding greatness of your power. That same power that you wrought in Christ when you raised him up from the dead. That is the power that is toward us. That is toward us, your people. Re Babara. Those that come to Zion, they go from strength to strength. Ah, Re Kabara. Can you declare that this evening? We are going from strength to strength. We are moving from strength to strength because we have come onto Mount Zion where an exchange is taking place. Re Babara, Re Gada. Lord, I bring the ashes. Can you lay down the ashes in your life right now? I say, Lord, Re Kabara. Oh, Re Kabara, Re Kazenda. Oh, you declare that the Spirit of the Lord is upon me. Oh, Re Kabara, because He has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor he has sent me oh to heal the broken hearted has your heart been broken very dear one broken your heart oh lord we come before you the healer of the broken heart ah yes that is who you are we receive we receive joy the oil of joy for morning we receive the garment of praise. Your praise has returned. Your praise has returned. I say your praise has returned. Uh, let me just share this little testimony. For a while, I had a running battle with asthma. And for someone who has sang all of his life, the devil is a bad devil. There's nothing good about him. But you know, the goodness of God is greater than the badness of the devil. It got to a time that I couldn't 
sing. I couldn't sing anymore. I couldn't even talk. Even to hold a normal conversation became difficult. You know, because asthma attacks the respiratory system. And you need air to breathe. If you can't breathe, you can't sing. And the devil then is a devil. But the Lord is greater. Ha, we have a song, you are greater than all. You are greater than all. And the same enemy will come around and say, <laughs> you know, if a salt has lost its saltiness, then it cannot, be, cannot profit anything. It's only useful to be trodden down underfoot by men and cast out. And I say, God, how can you be a singer and not be able to sing? Until one Wednesday evening. Until one Wednesday evening. One Wednesday. And guess what? I was alone at home. I was alone. I was just worshipping the Lord. As some of us will do at home. And, and the presence of God will come down. The power of God will come down. And the Lord showed me that, yes, the scripture says, if salt has lost its taste or its saltiness, it's not profitable for anything but to be cast down and thrown down underfoot. But he said, but you can come to me. I can restore your saltiness. I can restore your, your taste, your flavor. The Lord has restored me. Hallelujah. The Lord has restored me. Hallelujah. And guess what? I don't know what you're passing through. I remember I said, just alone with the Lord. Just worshiping the Lord. Out of a sincere heart. And the Lord will restore your flavor. Hallelujah. Restore your tastiness. Hallelujah. Your saltiness. As you return to him. That's what he did for me. Hallelujah. And it's no respect of persons. Hallelujah. No respect of persons. Who am I? You know, I, I say this at times. That, you know, thank God for the mercies of God. You know, the Bible tells us that the mercies of the Lord, that they are new everywhere, morning, and that his mercies endure forever. Abi, I usually tell myself, you know, I keep finding myself in situations where I say, oh Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. And then the Lord comes and builds me out. So one day I was just thinking to myself, thank God that these mercies are new every morning, you know. And that they never come to an end. If not, you would have finished the message of God. So I start, how many of us are thankful to God that his mercies are new every morning? <laughs> that his steadfast love never ceases. And his mercies never come to an end. Hallelujah. We have a final song. Um, and this song is pretty interesting to me. I hope it will become interesting to us. Hallelujah. To these glorious people here. Hallelujah. Please, can you just... Just receive the ministry. Where are my peeps? Caris. It's bright that has taught me to do this. So I'm following his footsteps. He brought me here. Uh, in any case, this is my first time of coming to Shekana night. And I, I hope to join you to worship again next time. <laughs> Amen. Now, that's Caris. Praise the Lord. Oh, oh, Caris. If he stands up, you really praise the Lord. <laughs> okay, Caris. And that is Isaiah. That is Akin. That is Pastor Jed. Jedidiah. That is Mrs. Tina Ehaza. That is Mrs. Edith Onakoya. That is Pastor Martins. Hallelujah. God bless this man. God bless him. And that is, you can see the hair. It looks like my own. Praise the Lord. <laughs> now you can see Chima Ike. That's my producer. May the Lord bless him in Jesus' name. And you see this young girl. This young girl. Started learning how to play the bass about um, is it two years ago. Huh? Two years ago. I mean, that kind of dedication and diligence I have never seen. She would come to church alone and stay with the bass guitar and be plucking just one note. Boom, 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 boom. And she would be there throughout the long vacation. She was there the whole vacation. The whole vacation. She was not watching Telemundo, my daughter. May the Lord bless you. She was not watching Zane World. Her, hey, I hope I'm still in the good books of all the... Nobody's smiling. Forgive me. <laughs> but how many of us have been blessed by our ministry? <laughs> Hallelujah. The Bible says, Seest thou a man diligent in his business? He will stand before kings, not before mean men. Now, on the 31st of December, 
the word of the Lord came to us in church through one of our pastors telling us that the year 2016 which was yet to come at the time that the year 2016 is our year of supernatural provisions and multiplication hmm. you know when that kind of a word comes to you on the 31st night at times the excitement of having entered the new year kinds of eclipses your consciousness of this revelation that has come and the need to give your time to meditate on it and ponder on it and receive it as your word but you know as the days began to unfold days went into weeks weeks went into months how many of us know that it's stated now that nigerians have never had it so bad you understand what i mean now we are told in hebrews 11 that by faith we understand that the ages were framed by the word of God. Now the word of God came to us. We are announcing that word to everyone that will receive that word. So that that word will frame your world. So that your world will not be at the mercy of the policies of our government. Hallelujah. Will not be at the mercy of what the World Bank and what IMF is uh, putting forth as the economic policy for global economics. Huh? Hallelujah. What is the word? It says, this is my year of supernatural provision and multiplication. Can you say with me? Can you say with me? Say, this is my year of supernatural provisions and multiplication. Can you say it again? Say, this is my year of supernatural provisions and multiplication. It would be lovely if you could put your name to it. Say, this is my year. Tayo Michael Bangushi. This is my year of supernatural provisions and multiplication and the word came from Matthew 14 and um, John 6 where Jesus fed the 5,000 if you get back home and look at that scripture you will see that Jesus fed the 5,000 in a deserted place in a wilderness with how many loaves five loaves and two fish in fact, somebody says small, so you can see how small they were. Now, I don't know how deserted your life, your finances, the economic activities in your life may be right now. But the God who did it back then is the same word yesterday, is the same today, and is the same word forevermore. Hallelujah. And guess what? What you have in your hand may be very little. Don't despise it. Don't look down on it. Jesus was given the five loaves of bread. And guess what? He lifted it up and did what? Offer thanks and blessed it. I don't know how small your income may be right now, but please, I beg you, don't despise it. It's the power of God that made that available to you. There are some that don't have it. So, can you just lift up your hand and say, Father, I thank you for what you have given me. I thank you for what is in my hand. I repent for ever despising what you have given me. I offer it to you, I bless you, and I thank you for it. Thank you, Lord, for receiving my thanks. In Jesus' name. Okay. Hallelujah. I'll sing. If I sing, can we put our hands together and say, Oh, oh. This is my year of supernatural provisions. This is my year of supernatural provisions. Multiplication. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. This is my year of supernatural provisions. This is my year of supernatural provisions. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. Multi Everybody, this is my year. Open over me, the 
the windows of heaven are opened over me and it is raining all over me and it is raining all over me this is my year is in my hand I look up to heaven and bless the Lord I look up to heaven and it is multiplied <laughs> oh, this is my year <laughs> multiplication 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 oh yeah oh, this is my year <laughs> Multiplication, multiplication, yeah. I believe the report of the Lord. I believe the word of the Lord. I open my mouth and I testify. I open my mouth and I declare His word. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. Oh yeah, come on. This is my year. This is my year. I never shut down. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. Voices around. This is my year. Lift up your voice. This is my year. Multiplication, 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 this is my year. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. Run it. Multiplication, multiplication, multiplication. That's what I have. Multiplication of my resources. Multiplication. Come on, come on, come on. Multiplication, multiplication, come on. Multiplication, multiplication. One more time. Multiplication. 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 Let's give the Lord a shout of victory.